Yeah, hello, hello, hello. Yeah, you are highly welcome to Charlie Viral Entertainment. And today we are looking at how a girl, a blind girl, won the food challenge. Here was the headline said. Ramsey Garden has, has asked a blind chef what question on national TV. And this was her reply. Stay tuned and see how she won the entire food challenge of her thing. She's amazing. Her cook is so fascinating. All I can say is she. Yeah. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, try, rush, go, comment, like, hit the like and subscribe button. Because in our next update, it's going to be more engaging and interesting. Love you all. Ramsey is getting served karma. Are you really blind? Yes, chef, I am. Gee, you cause a stir out there, literally. Yeah, I didn't mean it, actually. Some hot water for celebrity chef facing some payback. Everyone thought, how is this girl going to cook blind? <sighs> You're going to be judged like everybody else in this competition. Yes, chef. Gives a live crab to the blind chick. Let's give it to her. No more Mr. Nice Guy. <laughs> I'm freaking out for her. Honestly, Chef, there's just no excuse. I just was flustered. No one ever really thought that it could be this big. We did not grant her any advantages. Are you stupid? I hate his face. I want to prove you did try to screw me. I'm sorry, can you tell me where I had put the green onion? The green onion. Still in the bowl? Maybe he really wants her out. Back to that lady. I don't like her. She's weak. I think Christine will win this. As you know, there can only be one winner. Well, thank you. Um, first name is? My name is Christine. Christine, you've got five minutes to complete that dish. Thank you. And here she started a sweet meal and finished so quickly and so perfectly. Love her. Cool, dude. Yeah. Okay, there you. we are. Thank you. I hear the questions come up. Christine? And this is Anna. Were you born blind? No. Green onion. Still in the bowl? Uh, it should be right in front of you. It's right in front of me? Right in front yeah. of your hand. There we are. Okay. I started losing my vision around the same time that I started True teaching myself how to cook. Line, the game. But every time my vision would decrease, I would have to Stay teach tuned. myself again how do I use a stove or how do I use a knife. My mother was very overprotective of me. She didn't let me help her in the kitchen at all. She would tell me to stay away from the sharp knives or get away from the hot stove, so I didn't learn to cook with her. I was often embarrassed of the food that my mom used to pack when she took to school. Everyone was disgusted that it was smelly, but I regret to this day never having learned to cook with her. My mother actually died when I was 14, and all of a sudden part of my childhood was gone. And she left me no recipe. I've been trying to recreate the recipe. I love the fact you're taking everything. I have to, I can't see. I really loved cooking, but I thought it was going to be something I would have to give up. Not being able to see. I couldn't even eat something as simple as a peanut butter jelly sandwich. And I remember getting the peanut butter and the jelly all over the counter and not being able to align the two slices of bread together neatly. And I remember throwing away that sandwich and just thinking like, how am I ever going to cook for myself?
sorry. <sighs> you know, you're going to be judged like everybody else in this competition. Yes, Chef. In the history of MasterChef, we've never had a blind contestant. The personal challenge aside, for me, that's one of the most delicious dishes I've tasted in this competition so far. Do you know what I'm going to give you? A white apron. A white apron. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Christine's the most amazing woman I think I've ever seen in my entire life. She just amazes me at what she can do. It's delicious. Oh, thank you, Chef. It's fresh. It's fragrant. You cook. And guess what's up? They can only be one winner. And the winner is a blind girl. Her name is Constantine. What an amazing future. What an amazing status. What an amazing asset. She's very good. Oh, God. Players these days hurt. And please try, scroll down, like, and comment. Hit the subscribe Christine. button for more engaging moments later. Constantine. So, Christine, I'm doing When I cook, I feel loads. like my mom's spirit is somewhere nearby. If my mom were still here today, I would ask her to teach me how to make her Vietnamese beef noodle soup. Although each time I make it, it gets better and better, it has yet to still capture the memory of my mom. I think all of these things are a tribute to her and an homage to how my mom viewed food. Whether it's trying to get through challenges to win a cooking competition, to just trying to replicate my mom's beef noodle soup, you just have to try over and over until you succeed. Losing my vision taught me to be more fearless in life. If you can't see how steep the mountain is, then you can't fear it. And now, do well to scroll down, subscribe, like, and comment for larger and more better future days. Secondly, Charlie Vara Entertainment wish you well this great season. So you might as well try. Thanks. Greatest rewards come at the greatest risks.